Hello my friends, Virus here, and welcome back to Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Last time, we re returned to the Tropical Wilds, fought against the Shaggy Longlegs, and obtained half of the fruit in the area. Pretty good, if I do say so myself. And this time, we are going to go back into the Tropical Wilds, hopefully track down that wireless signal, and get the last piece of fruit we did not get. But first, let's talk. That signal. What on PNF4 could it be? Yes, that is a rubber ducky you're seeing floating around, and yes, that is Charlie's. When we reunited with Charlie, he brought it back aboard the ship. You think it really could be that person from Hokotade? Well, if it is, they would have a strong transmitter. Captain Olamare, I wonder. Let's track that signal ASAP. Alright, you heard the captain. Let's do it. All right, how do I want to do this day today? I definitely want a good amount of reds. Maybe 40. Still want a good amount of rocks. Maybe 30. Re yellows won't be all that useful, I don't think. So I think we just get 20 yellows and make the rest rocks. Oh, wait, no. Let's make the rest reds. I think this these are good numbers. Charlie, once again, you're not Charlie. Charlie, you'll go around and work for fruit. Okay. I think what I want to do is I'll do this puzzle later. I think for now I'll just bring him over to the burgeoning spider wart. And I will take Alf over this way. But if I see a, a pie a uh, a mound, I think I should take it. Yes, okay. This this mound is gonna be instrumental to what's coming up. Really glad we have all the pathways done too. Oh, you've already arrived, nice. Uh, let's get some rocks working on this. And are these all bombs? Yes. Okay. This is really good. Let's let them all pick up bomb rocks. Let's get you over... Not this way. It's the other way. <laughs> I'm very excited for this, what's to come, though. If it, if you've played Pikmin 3 before, or 3 Deluxe, for that matter, you would know what's coming up. Pretty sandy area. Maybe a, an arid area if you would say that. I don't know what I was trying to say, and look what we have here. And here we are. I changed up my numbers a little bit. I wasn't satisfied with how big my numbers were, so. And look at that. Looks like the source of the wireless signal to me. So this must have been the source of the signal that lured us here. Well, I'm sure I can scavenge, scavenge to a that to amplify the Drake's scanning range, so let's get it back to the ship. Our ship. But I don't want to do that just yet. Instead, I would like to go over here to this data file. And Belgian Mirror Slug number one. If they start sucking in, call them with the whistle to save them. And this one. If it shows its phase, attack it with Pikmin. Use the bomb rocks when it starts inhaling. Well, we have never come into contact with a mere slug that belches sand, so let's just start digging up this phone, shall we? This is the sand belching mere slug starting things off. He will be burrowing underground. You want to stay away from him as, if you would be so kind, he can eat some of the arena away and that can be a problem for you. But if you throw a bomb not into his mouth, that's bad. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to throw a bomb directly into his mouth and I think he's going to 
appear out of the Saiyan now. Nope, he's going to start inhaling. So you want to throw a bomb in there. It'll roll down, hit him in the mouth. And you want your potions for this. Go, 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 get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. The bombs do damage him, so that is a very good touch. Wait, where's my other Pikmin? Did one get eaten already? Wait, wait, wait. Did... It says there are 100 in the field. There are no idols. There are 10 working? Oh, there are 10 idols. Those are the ones I left with Charlie. I brought 70 reds. I don't know where it is. Okay, okay. We need to hurry. Whistle all of you back. I sincerely hope that none of you got crushed. It doesn't look like it. Alright. When he gets low on health, you want to stay the heck away from him. And he's not doing a good job at staying away from us. What the? I got a bad feeling about this one. He's low on energy. He will start getting most of the battlefield. Let's throw that rock. I think it's a little bit too late. It was. Okay. 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 We want to charge him now. Whistle all of you. Whistle all of you. I sincerely hope none of you got crushed again. Get him, get him, get him, get him. And he's down. Yes. And Sand Belcher, you definitely lived up to your name, but I also think you can be considered a melon belching mere slug. Defeat the sand belching mere slug for the first time in story mode. Very good. I think I will let the reds take this back. And I actually think I will give the corpse to the rocks, because the rocks need it the most. Well, I'll probably deposit some of these, so let's get let's get this uh let's get this melon back to base. I brought so many reds because they're just so adept at fighting. They do, I think, one and a half times the damage of normal Pikmin. So they were a really good choice for this. Come on. They seem to be getting stuck on this side. There we go. Come, what are you guys doing? Come on. There we go. Alright. <laughs> this guy doesn't know what he's doing. Alright, let's get this back to base. This one takes a whopping 15 Pikmin. I think that's enough. No. Here we go. Alright, let's take that back to base. And let's get this one back to base. Okay. Now that we have all the melon back to base, and we have the uh, transmitter going back to base, I think it's time we head back so we can let Charlie do his thing. And I think we need to give Charlie more rocks anyway, so that's okay. Okay. I'll just leave Charlie like right here next to the onion, because why not? They're in between an area. Are they coming out? Where are they? There they are. This is definitely going to give us a lot of juice, for sure. I don't know where I lost a red, though. I'm guessing it's back around here somewhere, maybe? I don't know where a red could have been missed, though. Yeah, because it says I still have all my Pikmin. I don't know where my 70th red went. Alright, let's get back to base before that thing can get analyzed. And let's deposit our 15 reds. No, I said let's deposit our 15 reds, not throw them. I'll get out... 10 more rocks. That should be enough for Charlie, right? Oh, and it's analyzing. All right. We're receiving a transmission from the Drake. Analyzing recovered item. Old data glutton. A communication device once used on this planet. Its signal strength is very powerful and it contains technology unknown to Kopai. Its transmitter is fully intact. If I can incorporate this and in, this technology into the Drake's communication system, I may be able to boost our signal strength even more. 
Oh boy, another all-nighter. Alright, Charlie, here are your rocks. Give you all those rocks. And you can go and claim your bounty. Well, it's not necessarily your bounty, but wait, is it still in here? I think it is. I hope it didn't start getting carried back. And I think Alf and Brittany can go over here and start doing this puzzle. Oh, sweet. I just got... <laughs> I just switched over to Charlie in time. This is really good. They do move a little bit slower when you're automating, so that's something to consider. Yes, it's still here. Okay. Perfect, and that is gruesome. He's just dragging him by the head once again. What is it with area bosses and getting dragged by the head? All right. Brittany, I think you should take all the yellows, and I will take all the reds. So I will give you all the yellows. So I will go over here. But, of course, I grab all the other Pikmin. Dismiss all of you. Let's go over here. <laughs> All right, yellows, you're coming with me. Okay, we gotta weigh this down. Let's weigh it down with like that many Pikmin. Probably should have given Alf some yellows in hindsight. In fact, I think I'll do that. I have half a day left. I'm fine. I'll give him, like, eight yellows. Why not? That should be enough, right, Elf? Hope so. So I think I need to be, like, right here. Alright. Actually, wait, no. I want to throw yellows because I need, uh... I need them to reach that. Sure hope I have enough, though. Let's dismiss you for now. So there's ten. And I already have a few yellows, I believe, up there, so... Just throw those. And it is enough, good. So Al should be lifted up now, very nice. And now we can get this fruit. Are you kidding me, I'm one short. Looks like I'm taking some reds after all. Oh, wait, I need to be on it. Alright. Now, let's get the, uh... Alright. Yellows are back. Alright. There we go. Now that I have reds, let's hope they can reach this. Okay. I was gonna say, if they can't reach that, I was gonna be pretty upset. Oh, I shouldn't have done that just yet. I'm just going to throw my yellows up here. So I have them here. And I guess I'll throw my reds up there as well. Can I really not throw my reds up there? I thought I did before, yes. Okay. Come on, there we go. Now I think I want to whistle Britney's Pikmin, right? I don't know why it's working now, it's so weird. Alright, now that raises up. Let's get my Pikmin. And this is how you normally get the, um... The other fruit, I believe. Get rid of this... This right here. I think I'm gonna get... I don't trust the AI. Hold up. I'll bring one brave Pikmin across with me. See? I knew he was going to get stuck on something or he was going to fall off. I don't know why I can't lock onto that. That's weird. Alright. Let's get these mushrooms out of the way. And there is a file over here. Hmm. And that Pikmin will work on that. I don't know where that cave takes us. So I think before... Oh, I kind of want to get that file, though. We'll come back for the file. 
Ah. Uh, oh no. Why did I take one Pikmin? Run. Run away. Run away. And we get... Oh, okay. Alright, where did I get thrown off? Alright, right here. Let me go over here, whistle my Pikmin. Yeah, the day's three quarters over. I'm gonna prioritize getting the Pikmin back, and then I'm gonna get the fruit. Alright, there we go. Let's go this way. Now, Brittany, you can get come and get this fruit. Now that Elf doesn't need help anymore. Alright. And I think that's all the fruit in this uh, area. For now, anyway. Yeah, I don't... It seems in this version, specifically, Pikmin 3 Deluxe, like, um, Pikmin have a harder time locking onto things, which is weird. Like, you saw that one Pikmin was just spinning around in a circle. Alright. Come here, friends. Now that we have the fruit back to base, don't really see much else to do. That, that peach we can't get for a while. We got all of this, right? Yeah, we got all of that. I think we go into that cave. I think we go into that cave. Because I think we do get fruit from that. So let's hope the Pikmin AI gods are on my side this time. Nope. Okay, I will dismiss you guys right... No! Okay. Dismiss you right here. I'm gonna go back. And no! Oh, come on! That... I hate this ledge. I've always hated this ledge. Okay. I need to hurry. Where's Brittany? Brittany's over here with 10 yellows. Okay. And our day's almost over. Okay. Let's get Alf back over here. This is probably the worst. Wait, does this even loop back around? It does. It's just the longer way, I think. Alright. Problem is, I don't know how many Pikmin I need. So I'll throw some over here. Just so Brittany can, um. Alright, I think this should be fine. And Brittany, I need you to whistle your Pikmin. I'm going to do what I want to do, and I need you to go get Alf's Pikmin that you did not bring with him. Very weird way to, to structure this day, but I didn't have anything better to do, you know? Okay. Can I please make it over this? Okay, no! Screw it, let's do it. Okay, apparently they don't stay whistled. Can it lock on to... We need to get those Pikmin. Nope, Alpha's is gonna... Nope. Okay. It's official, I hate that bridge. But we, we're not coming back here at third day. We'll just have to... Wait, where are those? Oh, crap. Are they over with Alf? They're over with Alf. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Whew. Okay. I think they specifically made... It feels like they made that... That natural bridge way worse than it used to be. Which is unfortunate because I can't I can't get past it. I don't know what it is. I just had so much trouble with that bridge. But we live another day.
I can't wait to taste the new fruit. I wish I had a watermelon right now. They're so good. Especially in the summertime when you put it in the fridge and it's nice and cool. Uh, Shane? I forgot what that- I think that's lemon juice, so I think- Yeah, watermelon lemonade could be good. I don't normally like watermelon flavored things, but I'm sure watermelon juice in lemonade is really good. Crimson Banquet, no doubt this one's gonna give the most juice out of all of them. Crimson Banquet, I almost forgot to call it by its name. Another Crimson Banquet. I think it does go in the order that you got them in, it looks like. Stellar Extrusion. I've always wanted- I think I have tried Starfruit at least once. Ooh, that's a pretty color. Yeah, I could have swore I've tried Starfruit uh, at least once. Don't remember really what it tastes like, but I'm sure it tastes good. I believe it's a type of citrus, too, which is very nice. Knowing this is waiting at the end of the day, it makes it all worth it. If only I didn't have to share it with the others. Wow, Brittany. Some team player you are. <laughs> this is great, we actually have a little bit of a juice buffer. Alright. Let's see how many rocks we have now. Not sure how many rocks we have. Let's see. Whoa, okay. We have plenty of rocks. <laughs> and we didn't lose any Pikmin today. That's really good. Charlie, let's go. We showed that beastly mirror slug who was boss and retrieved the communication device without incident. Alpha is working on incorporating the device's transmitter into the direct communication systems. The creatures on this planet will eat anything. What gluttons? I'm glad we could hide its art like that. Charlie. Me too, Charlie, me too. You can now fight the Sand Belching Mirror Slug and defeated bosses. Alright, that was a really good day. <laughs> so we beat the Sand Belching, Belching Mirror Slug. We got basically every piece of fruit we could, besides the one that I believe that Medusal Slurker drops. But I digress, it was still a good day. So next time on Pikmin 3 Deluxe, we see just where this expanded communication range will take us. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on it and subscribe so you don't miss the next episode. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Virus out.